Hi, I'm Holly. I'm one of the DIY craft instructors here at the Tarpon Springs Library. And today I'm going to show you how to make a macrame keychain. It's called a spiral knot, which I like to call a DNA strand because it exactly lo looks like a DNA strand. Um, so this is the packet that you would pick up at the library. And inside of it, you have two strings that are tw about 26 inches long. You have a plastic needle, a wooden bead, and a keychain. First, we are going to make a lark's head knot. With this, you place the two edges of the string together and pull it through the bottom of the lobster hook. Then pull the string through the loop at the end tightly. You will need to do this one more time. Separate the strings so they're not twisted together. Place a piece of tape over top of the lobster hook so it won't move. First, we are going to take the string on the end, cross it over the two in the center to form a loop. Take the string on the other end, cross over behind the two in the middle and through the loop. Make sure to pull very tight. Keep repeating this until you have three spirals. Stop making the knots when you have about three inches left on the outer strings. Next you will need your wooden bead. If you want to add a little color, you can add paint to the bead or use permanent marker. Now using the plastic needle, thread the two strings in the center through the bead. Pull the bead all the way through to the bottom of the knot. Take the two strings on the side around the bead so we can make a gathering knot at the bottom. Cut the two center strands to be the same size as the outer strings. Take one of the long strings and we will make our gathering knot. Have the end of the one string pointing up, then make a loop. Make sure it is exposed as we will use that later. Take the rest of the strand and wrap it around about three or four times. Put the end through the loop and pull on the string that is at the top. As you can see, it pulled the loop on the bottom through the end. Now cut the string on the top. Next we take apart the string which makes the tassel fringe.
cut the fringe to the size that you want it to be. Now you've made a cute macrame keychain. I hope you guys had fun making this craft. Be sure to send pictures of your keychain to us on social media. We would love to see them.